advertising is the name we in the security industry give to criminally controlled advertisements which intentionally infect people and businesses. These can be any ad on any site, often ones which you use as a part of your everyday internet usage, and it is a growing problem as is evident by a recent US Senate report and the establishment of bodies like Trust in Ads. Now whilst the technology being used in the background is very advanced, the way it presents to the person being infected is simple. To all intents and purposes, the advertisement looks the same as any other, but has been placed by criminal. Like you can see the mint ad out here, it's really out of place, so you could say it's been made by a criminal. Now without your knowledge, a tiny piece of code hidden deep in the advertisement is making your computer go to the criminal servers. These then catalog details about your computer and its location before choosing which piece of malware to send you. And this doesn't need a new browser window and you won't know about it. So basically, you're redirected to some criminal server, the malware injection takes place, and voila, you're infected. It's a pretty dangerous thing to be in. So how exactly can you stop malvertising? Well, first of all, you need to use an ad blocker, which is a very must in this day and age. You can have ad blocker extensions installed on your browser, whether it be Chrome, Safari, or Mozilla. Also, regular software updates of your browser and other software that put peripheral to your browser always has is some common sense. Any advertisement that is about a lottery that's offering you free money is probably going to scam you and inject a malware too. So never click on those ads.